right guys what's up it is week 11 of my glass city marathon training and uh, got started this week on monday march 15th with a spicy spicy my repeats workout so um, basically what we ended up doing was a couple mile warm-up per usual and then we went right into six uh six mile repeats followed by four 200s. So um, the mile repeats were done with 90 seconds rest and we did them um, We did them on the oval rather than the track because uh, uh, for part of the uh, repeat, we would hit the hill that was off of the oval. So th these mile repeats actually had hill, in, uh, hill incorporated into them to try to kind of get the lactate going in the legs uh, to try to simulate that. So I think it worked out very well actually uh, for, that, for that purpose. And uh, yeah, I think it was a great workout. Uh, you know, you guys will have seen the splits on the screen here, but um, yeah, I was hovering right around 504 for the majority of them and closed the last one in 455 just to kind of get a real quick one in there at the end. And um, I felt really good. I felt smooth. Legs felt solid. Um, didn't really even, didn't feel the 20 mile long run on Saturday. Legs feel fresh. I'm very happy with today and how it went. And I'm excited for another workout on probably Wednesday this week um we we're, might have to switch up and do the long run a little earlier in this week because next week I am doing the March Mad Dash 10 miler which is next Saturday um and so I won't be able to do my 21 uh what was planned for next Saturday which is the 21 mile long run I'm gonna have to adjust around that um so yeah we'll see we'll see what ends up happening here but uh, I will see you guys tomorrow for uh, Tuesday's Easy Run. Yo, what's up guys? Um, it is Thursday, March 18th, and you're probably thinking, hold up, March 18th? Well, yeah, I forgot to, I forgot yesterday and the day before to talk about my runs. So here I am, I'm gonna talk about all three of the runs right now, just real quick. All right guys, so on Tuesday, I did 11.02 miles uh, chilling at a 713 average pace, just um, trying to keep it nice and easy um, after Monday's workout, which was uh, pretty tough. So my legs were, you know, they were they, they were feeling actually pretty decent for what it's worth, um, surprisingly. Um, but anyway, that was what I did Tuesday. Uh, but yesterday, Wednesday, we did uh, for our workout, we did um, a eight mile tempo um, and. I, I think I ran right around 526 per mile average uh, after closing the last few miles in like 522, 522, 513. So, but the majority of it was run right at 530. So that's kind of my, my main tempo pace, but I was feeling good. So I decided to push it a little bit at the end and go a little bit faster. Um, just testing my fitness out guys. And uh, I, I really do feel that, uh, that I'm making big fitness gains here. I'm feeling a lot better. Um, on my on my runs recently, the, even these easy runs that are like 11 miles, they don't feel mu like much anymore because um, it used to feel pretty tough to do something like that. Um, so yeah, guys, that was yesterday. Uh, it was a great workout. I'm really happy with how it went, and um, definitely a big confidence booster, by the way, for the uh, March Mad Dash 10 miler I'm doing, which I registered for a while back. And that is next Saturday. So to know that I can do eight at a 526 average um, in just a workout. Uh, I think it's fair to shoot for um, mid to low 520 pace average for the 10 miler. Um, anyway, guys, that's what I did yesterday. And today, March 18th, Thursday, I just did another 11 easy, um, this time at a 714 average. So pretty much the same pace, um, just keeping it nice and easy. It's what felt easy today. It was not pleasant conditions today. It was, it was very rainy. Uh, lots of uh, puddles and stuff like that. Just raining the entirety of the run. It's been raining all day today because you know it always freaking rains. And it always rains in Pittsburgh, apparently. Um, I don't know why they always say that though. I feel like it does. It hasn't rained a lot here compared to what it normally does. But um, yeah, I did get decked um, by a big splash from a car today. Uh, there was like a there was like a hole in the in the road and I was just running. I wasn't really paying attention. I had my hat on with like a uh, raincoat on. So I, I, my vision was closed off. I can't see in my peripherals. So I didn't see that this car was coming up from behind and was going to uh, hit and in, go into that hole that was filled with water. And so it, it drove by pretty fast and hit that hole and just water went all over me. It was, it was insane. 
Um, it was pretty funny though. I was I was laughing. I was already like nine in, so I was I was okay with getting. I was already soaked anyway, so it didn't really make any difference. Um, but yeah, it was a uh, you know I was in the splash zone there. But uh, all right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow for another easy run, and then um, Saturday uh, we'll be doing a 20, 20 to 21 mile uh, long run workout. So I'll see you tomorrow after the easy run. Peace. What's up, guys? It is Friday, March 19th, and I just got back from my easy run for the day. So I just went out uh, about nine miles, uh, seven, 714 pace, I believe. Um, just, you know, kind of cruising, taking it easy before tomorrow's long run. So. Yeah, there's not much to today. Uh, I went and hit the oval just to baby my legs a little bit, take care of the legs, cause it's like uh, gravel, but uh, crushed gravel. So it's nice on the legs. So I decided to go there just to take it easy on them before tomorrow's long run, um, which I will be doing in North Park, uh, which is actually where the course is for the March Mad Dash 10 miler, which I mentioned yesterday. Um, and that, that, that which is next Saturday. So that's actually the course for that. So we just wanted to get a little preview and do a long run there. So. Should be good, guys. Um, I'll see you tomorrow after the long run. Yo, what's up, guys? I uh, just got back Saturday, March 20th. Just got back from a long run at North Park, like I was talking about yesterday. Uh, it was a nice loop. I, I like the lake loop. Um, it is right around five miles, so yeah, doing it twice on next this next Saturday for the 10 miler. Um, but it was nice just to get a course preview so I can get a feel for what, the lay of the land and. Um, I mean, it was it was kind of rolly a little bit, but I think it's going to be a fast course, so I'm still I'm not um, going to do much adjusting for my goal. I mean, I think my original goal was maybe like low to mid 520s at at, at best, like if I had a good day. Um, but you know, at, at, I think maybe more around mid 520s to 530 now, just after running on it, seeing it being a little rolly, but. Um, anyways, guys, I'll give you the stats for the day. It was uh, 21 miles and um, did it at 6.33 average pace. So it was a workout incorporated into it. So after about 10 mile warm up, uh, Carmo, me and Patrick all started a little bit of a fart lick session. So it was four by, uh, four, by four minutes on, one minute off, three minutes on, one minute off, two minutes on, one minute off, one minute on, one minute off. So it was four, four three, two, one on with the one minute offs in between each as rest. Um, and the one offs were still not too too slow. They were like sub seven pace still, um, but it was a great workout. The ons, we ended up being averaging right around, um, five, if I had to guess, 545 to 550 pace. Uh, so it was a good workout. I'm very, I'm very happy with it. Uh, finished the workout around 19 and a half miles, which was nice because I only had to do a mile and a half cool down um, to get the 21. So yeah, very happy with it guys. Uh, at 76 for the week, so I'll just have to do four tomorrow um, and uh, hope to get some footage for that. So I'll see you after tomorrow's easy run. All right, guys, I just got back uh, from my easy run. It is Sunday, March 21st, and uh, yeah, it's took it nice and easy today to um, kind of shake out after yesterday's long run, get the lactic acid out of my legs. Um, felt really good. Uh, I guess today, 734 pace felt easy to me. So I didn't, I tried not to look at the watch much today, just, you know, kind of considering today is kind of like a rest day, active recovery day. Um, and yeah, I mean, 5.75 miles, so almost six. Uh, if I did 0.1 more, I would have gotten 82 miles on the week. So I got 81.9 miles according to Garmin here. Uh, very close, but uh, that's okay. I'm, I was just shooting for 80, so I went a little bit over, I guess, uh, which is fine. Um, I just wanted to shake out the legs today, so I went a little longer than I had to. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, that was this week for my training, uh, week 11, I believe, I hope. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, you know, if you did, share it around, share it to your friends. If you enjoyed the video, um, spread the word, my channel, try to get, get my uh, content out there to you guys. So anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video.